that I'd like to tie for you an emerging caddis. The hook I have in the vise is a size 16 curved shank. The thread I'm going to use is olive brown. I'm going to put a base of thread down on the hook. Take it down around the bend a bit. This is a good fly to use when the trout are feeding on the emerging caddis. For the body I'm going to use Deer Creek Super Select Seal Fur. This is Northern Lights and it has sparkle in it. I'm going to wax my thread. Turn that slightly so I can dub it easier. Yeah, we're going to wrap the body up. We can use just the pinch more And I'm just going to trim off the big ones. Now I have a piece of tan Swiss straw. And I took it apart until I have like two sheets. I'm going to tie it on the side. This is going to help represent the air bubble. Oop, slid around on me. And you can see, you can see right through that. I'm going to bring this over and tie it in on this side. Now I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to cut that. I'm going to cut it at an angle just behind the body. I'm going to take the mallard dyed lemon wood duck. And we're going to take about six of these or so. We're going to lay it down across the back. We're going to let that extend. We want this almost twice the length of the body. Take away that excess. I'm going to take the partridge feather. I cut the tip out. I'm going to hold them down underneath. And tie them in. And they're going to be going alongside the Swiss straw. And down. I'm going to take just a small amount of black Antron. For the head. And I'm going to whip finish.
Here we have an emerging caddis. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope you would subscribe to my channel. Please refer me to your friends, leave comments, questions, suggestions, and most of all, I thank you very much for watching my videos.